Hey guys, this is Martin, the Hungarian ambassador of OPPO. Hey guys, this is Martin, the Hungarian ambassador of OPPO. And in this super quick vi video, hey guys, this is Martin, the Hungarian ambassador of OPPO. And in this super quick video, I'm going to show you how easy it is to put uh, colorless betas on your Find 7a phone and how easy it is to root your phone. So both of these processes are essential to the Android power user and you're going to be doing this uh, probably very often on your Find 7a because not all of the updates, especially beta softwares, are not, they don't come in over the air updates, only the stable versions get OTAs. So uh, this is going to be essential for you and it does not void your warranty. Two thumbs up for that for Oppo. So let's take a look at how this, how this works swiveling my N1's camera over here and we open our phone up here let me just refocus very quickly so what you will be doing here is uh, I have a colorless 1. Uh, yeah, 1.2 running on, on this phone so first of all I'm gonna turn it off I hit power off uh, yeah there you go then then you're gonna be going into your recovery mode. Uh, I have Oppo stock in, uh, recovery installed on this phone, so I'm gonna be hitting the power volume down and power button at the same time. You're gonna be doing that until you see the Oppo logo appear. Then you can let go of the buttons. I'll pull Ollie into the picture. Uh, don't fall over Ollie. There you go. And soon you'll be greeted by the recovery. You select your language, which I suppose is English if you're listening to this, and then you're gonna be hitting, first of all, wipe data and cache. So you have to do that for all of the, uh, you're gonna have to be doing that for all of the uh, ColorOS updates probably. Uh, you're always advised to do that. So that was super fast. And then you're gonna be doing install from SD and then I put my stuff in mobile storage. Uh, by the way, I'm going to put all the download links into the description below. So you can download all of the ROMs from Oppo's forums. So that's super simple. And you should probably put the files at the root of your phone. You can see that I have three installable zip files here. And for this video, I'm going to show you how to put the stable ColorOS 1.2 uh, on the phone. So that's, that's this file here. I'm going to hit it and click yes and that's it that's really as simple as it is I'm don't know how long this is gonna take but I might cut this video if it takes very long but even until then keep in mind that this does not void your warranty and you should do uh, recovery of your uh, I mean a backup of, of uh, all the user settings you can use oppose uh, own backup and recovery tool, but I don't really advise to do that because it loses a lot of the data. Sometimes it, it works for me for most of the applications, uh, but then for some it doesn't, and and then sometimes it up it uh, backs up the launcher as well. Sometimes it doesn't, so it's really a hit or miss. It's better than nothing, but um, I'd probably revert to something like Titanium Backup if if you want to be sure of. Uh, keeping all the data. I'm not very uh, worried about keeping my data in the applications because I don't I don't do any gaming or, or anything where I would lose a lot of my progress. But if you if you do that, keep in mind that you should always uh, back up your stuff before wiping all of the data, all of the user data at least on your phone. So uh, the update is getting closer and closer to finishing up. And there we are. So, installation successful. Well, it's a bit of a mistranslation here because you either reboot or yes, but yes just brings you back here. So, since uh, we've already installed the newest version of, uh, well, not the newest version, well, the version that I put on the phone so this is already installed but before I want to go in there I want to root the phone so again uh, if you want to root just go into the Oppo stock recovery and you hit install from SD uh, again mobile phone storage and then there's this link here which Kidros who is our ex Hong Kongese ambassador put online so I'll put a description uh, I'll put a video no I'll put a link into the video description to that as well and uh, thumbs up for Kidros for 
putting that on the forums. So it's as easy as this. You hit it and you're done. And now you just reboot and you have your new ColorOS running on your phone uh, and it will be rooted. So uh, of course you have to uh, wait a bit longer here and you have to set up the whole phone again. But there you have it. You have successfully installed ColorOS and rooted it in just, I think, under two or three minutes. So, cheers.